New changes to federal regulations means Oklahomans who were once told they couldn't donate blood are now eligible, saving more lives across the state. News 4's Adria Gowen spoke with the Oklahoma Blood Institute about these changes. The FDA reversed a ban preventing people who spent time overseas, potentially at risk of mad cow disease, from donating blood, now making thousands of Oklahomans eligible. The key is making people aware. The 20 year old ban included people who spent time in the UK during the 80s and 90s, or in France and Ireland from 1980 to 2001, affecting nearly 18,000 Oklahomans, including many military families like those at Tinker who lived abroad. Many donors haven't even tried to donate blood because they knew about the deferral. And now they can. The move allows the Oklahoma Blood Institute greater opportunity to fill an overwhelming need for donations. It's a constant, you know, roller coaster. I mean, the numbers, even when they're good, all it takes is a few emergency situations to where the supply is dwindled. The reversal could lead to more changes to federal bans on blood donations. At one point, there was a lifetime ban on members of the LGBTQ plus community. But over the years, that ban has become less restrictive. The FDA is constantly reviewing the regulations to see where we can make improvements. More donors means more lives saved. In Oklahoma City, Adria Goins, Oklahoma's News 4.